Veterans Memorial Academy was supposed to host their sixth annual quinceanera tonight, an event put together for girls who can't afford one. CBS 4's Jolani Martinez spoke with one principal on how the pandemic has affected their plans. This morning I got up, put on a suit because I was going to a meeting. I said, oh, I could be getting dressed for the quinceanera. <laughs> an empty gym. And then we have the stage here. It was supposed to be filled with flowers, pinatas, and 60 girls in their quinceanera dresses. We would be almost finished and everybody go home and put on their tux and get dressed. Right now we would have been uh, finishing up, uh, decorating, setting up everything for the event. But after an entire year of planning. Start doing the invitations, picking the theme, getting the sponsors. So by the time the quinceanera comes around, everything's already done. Veterans Memorial Academy canceled their annual quinceanera, an event Principal Gilberto Galvan and his staff look forward to each year. It was hard. It was hard for them and it's hard for us because we enjoy doing this for the girls. But since I don't have daughters, well, it's like I'm making a quinceanera for my 30, 40, 50 daughters and it's really, really exciting. Um, the whole event planning is so exciting. Getting the sponsors, organizing everything, it's a lot of fun. These are the dresses the girls were supposed to wear this evening, but in the meantime, they will be stored right here on campus, waiting for them to be worn at the even bigger celebration. Since we had all these girls that their dream didn't come through, next year we planned, uh, my, we were having a discussion and my, my librarian said, maybe we could do quinceanera slash sweet 16. The way those girls have the opportunities. It'll be twice as big and even better. Galvan says they're expecting to celebrate about 100 students at next year's Sweet 16 and Quinceanera. Reporting in San Benito with Complete Valley coverage, Jolani Martinez, CBS4 Valley at 6.